Hey guys, happy homebrew Wednesday. Cheers. Tailboy here. Oh, fuck it's hot. <laughs> so, uh, must be in the 30s here today. We've got a, a bit of a hot snap. Some, um, a heat waves come over from Aussie and we've copped it. So, uh, you know, sitting back a few cold ones and just chilling out. public holiday here today, now some Tasman anniversary day, so I've got a week off from work, so that's pretty sweet, uh, and I used it uh, productively, yesterday I put down a, um, a Cooper's Pale Ale, uh, just a sixed up tin, um, I think I've put in some Citra and Mosaic just to give it a real bit of a hot bomb taste. Um, back to playing with the controls downstairs on the different on an older cam. Um, we'll see how this pans out. The computer's a bit loud. You can hear a whirring and a buzzing, and that's the old a running off Vista. Um, it won't let me update to Windows 10 for some reason. I've got to download an iOS file and fuck around with that. But, um, yeah, so uh, uh, I'm still looking for a washer for the. For the uh, for the mesh ton, I might pop down. There's a place down the road. I might grab one from there. Same as steel, copper one. So it should be all good. Uh, I wanted to do a, a all grain a clone uh, later on. A couple of days time. Uh, time time willing, you might be able to get that done. Fingers crossed. It was good to hear that some local uh, small microbreweries picked up some international awards uh, recently. I think one was from the uh, the big uh, home brewers convention they have in um, Australia there. So that's uh, good. Good to see the good to see the uh, local home brewers getting some recognition. Drop this, it's another Montes. Uh, great divide pale ale. Very refreshing, very sessionable. Um, but yeah, just kicking back on a bloody hot um, anniversary day here. Uh, planning my next brew. What I'm going to do, I'm going to add to it. But, uh, yeah, I'll wrap this one up here. Cheers, guys. Enjoy your uh, homebrew Wednesday. And keep on rocking those beers out. Cheers. Nice lacy, nice heat on that one. It actually came out half frozen because I left it in. I've got the, I've got the fermenting fridge on at 18, but because <coughs> it's so bloody hot. Uh, the compressor's going on, uh, it's compressing every three and a half minutes, sometimes it's, it's, uh, it's having to go on delay, and uh, so I can still use the freezer as a, as a, as a deep fridge I suppose, so it's, yeah, it's pretty good, handy to have to swap all my hops and bloody yeast over to the upstairs fridge. Cheers guys.